Healthcare workers across Connecticut have a difficult decision, get vaccinated or lose their jobs. The deadlines are quickly approaching today and tomorrow, but the impact can already be felt. We had nurses here that was here for over 30 years and they denied the vaccination and, and unfortunately they had got terminated. That could be the case for hundreds of people over the next couple of weeks. All major health care systems in Connecticut are mandating vaccinations. Still, more than a thousand workers across the state haven't gotten their shots. At Trinity Health of New England, at least 95% of their employees are vaccinated. Their deadline was last week. Hartford Healthcare has vaccinated at least 97% of its employees, hoping the last 3% will get their shots by the end of the day Thursday. At at Yale New Haven Health, they're looking at a 99% vaccination rate, but they still have more than 400 unvaccinated workers facing possible termination. I would anticipate that between 100 and 200 people unfortunately end up leaving the organization. Dr. Om Deshpande says each day managers at Yale New Haven are meeting with employees about the mandate. 400 people alone have decided to get their shots since last week. On Monday, all unvaccinated workers got a verbal warning. If they're not vaccinated by next week, they'll get a written warning. A week after that, they'll lose their jobs. I know it's not been easy for the people who have been a little reluctant to get vaccinated, but it's clearly having a desired effect. And I'm incredibly grateful that so many people have ultimately made the right decision. The thought of losing hundreds of workers keeps managers up at night, but they hope they won't have to. If those individuals, uh, and I hope they do, get vaccinated, we will absolutely welcome them back with open arms. Hospitals, I feel like you should get it if that's what you want to do, just to protect yourself and your loved ones. But it's, again, it should be a choice. It shouldn't be mandatory. Julia LeBlanc, Fox 61 News.